Hi, I'm Tom Dees with Keller Williams Realty, and today we're going to discuss what happens to the real estate market in an election year. And as always, if you're interested in buying or selling a home, please click on the corresponding links. Stick around. Welcome back. We've crunched some numbers and using some historical data from the California Association of Realtors, and we've identified that values and appreciation during an election year do not increase at the rate that they do during a normal year. And looking at some local numbers with some uh, trend graphics in our local market, to give you an example, the number of homes going on the market month over month has increased at 10%. So in other words, there's 10% more homes going on the market now than went on the market last month. Comparatively speaking, the number of solds month over month is at 1.9%. So there's more inventory, more choices, and the buyers are taking a little bit longer to make a decision. And to put this in layman terms, you might say that the market was going at the rate of 110 miles an hour about a month ago. Now it's going at the rate of about 65 miles an hour, which is still strong. It's extremely brisk, but we're not receiving five to 10 multiple offers. We're only receiving maybe one to two, maybe three multiple offers. So there's still a window of opportunity for any seller that wants to capture peak values. So give us a call if you have any questions or if you'd like to know the current market value of your home, give us a call or send us an email or click on the link. Thank you very much and have a great day.